Hello everyone and welcome to Pro Road Racing League here to race. Uh this is this is a pink, tiny penguin the commentator. Working so got seven drivers today. Bit of a small turnout but like It'll be fine. I'll have to see which one of the of this seven is out first. Looks like Tyler's first one out on track. The Aston Martin first out on track. Looks like Z is also leaving. Also one of the McLarens is also leaving is Vossi. See who who is out next. Probably put that on. Swag is out now. So, Beg Archie, Adri, and is staying in the. Okay, it's, it's now pinged on Discord. That stream is up. Very nice. So welcome, welcome everyone. Here we are for the Bar Bahrain Grand Prix, the Tier Two race. So see what everyone can do. See qualifying can be a, a little bit boring when everyone's on an outlap. So it's just Arch, Chief and Mickey left in the pits. We'll ride on board of Tyler as they're about to start their lap. We also probably have the, no, not that one on. Coming to the first corner. Very tight, very tight turn one hit, Bahrain Grand Prix. Up to the second DRS zone, flaps wide open. Most of track limits there. Oh, little squirrely there. Oh, another slight um, mistake there from Tyler. But they're gonna carry on with that, even with the small mistake there. Because like, they got loose at the, the rear end, got a little. Down to turns nine and ten. It's in tight in turn. Run. Run up. I can do this. Round two, round turn eleven, pretty much. I think he can almost take this flat out. Been up before. Obviously, the graphic is showing the same purple sectors because they're first, first person out on track, person on side lap. Around the last corner for Tyler. Run out of battery, but it's up to the line. Now it's a 119 0 start off. It was next next on a on a lap. I think it's Vossi. Yep. McLaren driver. Going around to turn twelve and thirteen. Down the long back nice long back straight. Put to the floor, down the hill. Round in the last couple corners. So they still got power down up to the line now, and it's a 127 8. We'll see, by 127 8. We'll set full second fast. And Z has come across the line as Pemp slower than Tyler. Next one to come across is Twag across the line, slower 1.4. Uh, up, up, up. Left the pitch yet. Adri, the line, P2. 
Still in the pits. About to start their first flyer. Apparently on their first first laps of this year's game. Vicky said said on Discord they've had zero practice on this game. This is literally their first laps. See what what see what do. Ready for a couple corners. Here is wide open. Up, up to turn four. That nicely. Down the hill. It's twisty. Five, six, seven. Down to the hairpin at ten. Oh, bit too much. Bit a little bit too much curb there for me. Say so into nine and ten. Very tight. Oh, in there. A little bit too much curb, I think. It's entirely. Boards. Very nice there, and tidy. Oven. Last couple corners, the fly fire. Cross the line for the McLaren. It's a one foot point eight. But I don't blame me. Said so make first first couple of laps of this game. Just Arch Chief left at a lap. About ten minutes left of the session. Everyone's posting a banker, but I'm pretty sure everyone can get past it. See what everyone else does. Actually, might just be leaving at the very end. That looks like Tyler's gone back out. But a second point two seconds off Volti. See if they faster a bit faster. I also should fresh uh, tires. One of me come in on. I have a small as well that me. I have put too many lap laps. Probably gonna do a few laps of. They haven't had any practice on probably should. Dive into the pit, so they're... Go for another... Right open, oh, that's Adri at the pits, and... We'll have to get out of the way. Five for blocking the pit, pit exit. Ooh, bit too much. See on the pit side. Eight, five, six. Pretty good there. Ten. Like that. I missed what the sector. The hill. Fast on. That's a nine tenth improvement for me. It's purple middle sector as well. Might be close to Vossi. Close to see. First run. Cross the line. It's a full second and a half faster. 0.5 off of. 
bad. Whereas Tyler's two temps up in the middle a lap. Down the back straight. Four call. Pedal turn. Up for the Add six milliseconds up on that. Now currently second. See. Just backed out of that lap of flags doing it. And I got arch chief foot on the top. Got Zeet. Two temps up on their previous best. They improve. Right the board of arch chief. Array. No, why it's purple sector one. Oh, a tw tw okay, them in. Let's see if they can pick up the pace through the rest of the lap. A little wide. Went a little wide there. X there. A little bit on the bit. Take it now. On to. Like they barely broke that. Down the last straight. Around the last couple of corners. Oh, big slide! Big slide! But they run out of battery across the line for Arch Chief on 30.8. Arch Chief. Flags come back out on track. Prove their 1.4. Like Adri's also back out on track, so both the V hops are back on track.
They're going for a double outlap then. Tires. Looks like Rossi's also back on. Well, both both McLarens are back on track. Two after the session. Got some. Wanted. Okay, did more than someone. And again, eight person. In. Hopefully, they can join. Well, yeah. This will be like everyone's final run. The question is, will Arch Chief get out of the garage in time to? Have to get out of the garage with about one left. Get back out. As long as you can cut around the Bahrain track to get down faster. I don't think. I'm but now it's a thing. Oh, no. Oh. Must have cut the entire of turn one and then S. Places you can cut, but I think Archchief has left it a little bit too late to really set another time. We'll have to see though if they they can get back round. As Adri, Adri is six tenths up on their best lap so far. We'll have to see what the V carb can do. Coming down the last straight now into the duck the last couple corners. Adri crossed and up the line. Now how much improvement? It's only four tenths in the end. But the six tenths off of Vossi. Who's on another lap and probably improving. A tenth up on their previous previous but Ooh, little snap though there though. Like it's bossy. As I think, yeah, you you left you left too late. Left too late after. Bossy a little bit down in the middle sector. I wonder if they got blocked a little bit there by Archchief. Well, checkered flag has fallen, so you want another flying lap. This is your last run. We'll have to see what happens here. So Vossi, can they extend their lead at the front? They've chosen to not. Chosen to back out. The next one across the line will be his teammate Mickey. We'll have to, we'll have to see what the, his teammate can do. Went up to the line. How much of an improvement is it for the McLaren? It's a two tenth improvement, which sees some P4. Where's Swag going? Swag six times faster, but still stays P6. His teammate will be next across the line, but I don't know if they're on an in lap or on another flyer. Find out in a minute. Oh, they're backing up. That they're on. Next one across them will be Tyler. How much faster are they going to be? Seven tenth improvement. They take P2 away from Adri. Now it's just Zeep to come across the line to effectively deny Vossi of P1. We'll have to see what the Mercedes can do. Coming around the last couple of corners now. Zeep was. There's a couple of tenths up in the middle sector. Went across the line now. And they're down. They actually lost time in the final sector. That is unfortunate. So, Bossy will claim the first pole then of the tier 2 season. This tier 2 season. Tyler will take P P2. Ad Adri free. Then Mickey, Deet, Swag, and then Archie. Quickly, we can get the last person in. Like a bossy, not very happy with that. Bossy has always been quick because I was in the tier. I was in the tier two last season with Bossy, and that man was absolutely flying. Always challenging for the win. Was Vossi. Yeah. 
We are just now waiting on people to finalize their setups for the race. That's one thing, sadly. If you want to join the race, you gotta, you gotta be his for quality finish. Get in before quality finishes, then you'll get to run in the race. If you're a little, if you're a little late, then you were. Uh, Right, here we go then. Oh, yep, I forgot. We have a formation lap. <laughs> I, I I forget sometimes, because in other racing leagues I'm in, there isn't a formation lap. I forget for this one there is, we have one. I was, I was getting ready to say fi five lights are on and away we go. Oops. Like, I'm still not used to it. So I think this is the only race league that actually does formation laps I'm in. But I don't know. But we'll have to see what Wossy can do then from the lead. Obviously, in qualifying, people are probably just like not showing their true pace. I think that's the thing with Archchief. I think if they could have set another lap, they could have shown their real pace. But they didn't, didn't get to, so we'll see what they can do from the back. Obviously, we'll have to see how Miki can do. Obviously, that man was having wheel issues. They can do. If if the if their pace is was if their pace was shown in quality, I, I'm expecting Vossi to have like a two second gap after the, like maybe the second lap. But we can we will soon find out. Pretty much all the drivers are now onto their last straight. Just Archchief lagging a little bit behind. Oh, and he's actually he's span it. Oh, he's also on the hard tire, which is interesting. That's a point. Yeah, let's have a look. A quick look at the tire strats people are doing. It looks like Ty both Tyler and Swag have opted for the soft tire. Pretty much everyone else is on mediums except for Archchief. Who's looking to go long in this race then. If they're going to start on the hard tyre. They are looking to go long in this race. So we'll have to see what they can do. Right, the cars are finally lined up for lined up on the grid. Waiting for Archchief to get in position. There we go. Everyone's ready. Five lights are on. And away we go for the Bahrain Grand Prix. Look, It looks like it's a... Bad start for Vossi there, losing two places straight away. Maybe a third to their own teammates, so Tyler takes the lead into turn one. Looks like Miki was trying to go for an in a move on the inside of Adri, but didn't get quite to get it. So Vossi's, Vossi's got back, back past his teammate, but he's struggled to get off the line there. What a shame, what a bad start that is. We can also see Zeke making a move, trying to make a move on the inside of Swag, but like, it's the... The soft tire versus the medium, so the soft tire runner will have more grip. So that'll explain why Tyler's had a good start then. Up into the lead already. And has already broken pretty much DRS already to Adri behind. So it looks like Tyler might run away from this. Might get an early lead. Obviously right now Vossi's all over, it, all over the back of the V-carb there. They might make, wait until the main straight to really make a move. We've got, obviously, Miki got Swag behind. Obviously, Swag's on the medium tyre, and then, obviously, Archchief is really lagging behind. But then again, that's that's the hard tyre for you. And it looks like Tyler's bro already bro almost got a two-second gap to Adri on, the fir on this first lap here. But I'm not surprised, because it's soft tyres versus mediums. 
And like I also expect Vossi to probably blitz past the V cab here on the main straight. Well as I see. Burn burning that battery. Look at the overspeed. Down the inside goes the McLaren driver and it's a clean overtaking to turn one. So now they'll start chasing chasing after Tyler. We'll have to see if Adri can follow them behind. Also, Mickey's a getting being bullied here by the look of it by Spike. Who's also getting bullied um by Zeet. DRS also has been enabled this lap. Oh a big mistake there from Swag. So it looks like Zeke goes into fifth on the back of Mickey, but Swag's on the soft tyre, so they should catch back up pretty quickly. Oh, and Talus! Oh, Talus made a mistake. I've missed this. Talus made a massive mistake, and Vossi and Adri have both gone past the Aston Martin. But the Aston is pushing the V cab through that corner. DRS open for both drivers. We'll have to see if he tra fancies a move before turn 11, but it doesn't not look like it. So I wonder what's happened there then to Tyler. They made a massive mistake out of turn eight, by the may maybe. Maybe got themselves into a semi-spin. It seems unlikely because they're on a soft tire. You've got so much grip on that tire. We'll have, to, we'll have to see if Tyler will make the move down to turn one then. But with the front three here so close together, they've got like a three second gap to Mickey and fourth. So I think it's just going to be the fight between these three for the race, race win. We'll have to see if both of them go blitzing past the McLaren to turn one. Adri looking very close in the V-Cab. Are they going to make a move? No, they choose not to. Bazit has got past Mickey behind them. Also, Swag is caught back up. Ooh, later on the brakes, try, maybe try to go around the outside of Mickey there, but unfortunately, we'll have to see if Mickey makes a move into, ter into turn four. There's nothing that none of the leaders are swapping places. Oh, I thought Mickey was going to go under there. But these, these three are staying pretty close together. But they've dropped four seconds off the three leaders. Which Vossi still holds. With Adri and following behind then Tyler. And obviously Archchief is in a world of his own on the our tyre. Looks like Tyler's closer to Adri this time around. Maybe he fancies a move into t before turn 11. Nope, doesn't look like it. Oh, almost hit in the back of the V carb though. Oh, it looks like oh, it looks like Adrian's lost DRS. Looks like Vossi's broken DRS now. Let's we'll see if Tyler can get past Adri quick to get back in the back in the DRS. Maybe Adri might burn battery to try and get back in DRS so he's got it himself. But we don't know. Looks like Tyler's just pushing Adri through the corner there. This is oh a small small wiggle there from the V carb. This is Tyler's chance to take P2 away from the V carb. Down the side by side coming into turn, coming into the turn one. They're both trying to be late on the brakes to get the move done. It looks like Tyler's finally got it. May have picked up a warning there for track limits as well. But Adri will probably try and get them back into turn four. Look at the freaking overspeed. On the inside, leave both drivers. Leave, Tyler leaving plenty of space there. Oh, but massive snap and for Adri then. So they've lost lost a bit of time to the thing, the the Aston Man. But looks like this Swag and Mickey going side by side. But Swag gets bullied out by Mickey, and now he's side by side with Zeet. Zeet trying to go around the outside of outside of them. But it doesn't look like the Mercedes driver will have to settle back in behind them. But the more they fight, the more they drop off the up, off of Adri. It's like still on the back of still on the back of Tyler, but they've both like Vossi has a two second gap now to the uh, driver in second. So Oh, looks like Zeke up oh, Zeke got the corner. Zeta's Looking very racy here, trying to get catch back up to them. Looks like Archchief has finally start found their rhythm and is slowly catching back up to these three. Right, this free horse race here for the P4 might become a thing. Oh, Tyler's in. Tyler's off those softs immediately. So only a lap, only lap five of those tyres lasted. 
Looks like Swag's got going past Mickey again down to turn one. Oh, I thought Z was gonna try a late move there. Yeah, but it looks like Archie was really caught but catching back up to these guys. Like obviously Swag's on the soft tires, so they should be dying round about now. Because I'm pretty sure the tire wear at bar is is kinda bad. Ah, uh, fucking hell. Oops. Sorry, bad language. I have to, uh... I have to, sorry, quickly tap out. Um, yeah. Sus link in chat, sorry, I had to tap out. So if I miss something important in this racing, I... That's my bad. So it looks like Archchief is really caught back up to these, up to these guys. Like obviously, oh, Swag's also dropped off the back, so maybe he's made a mistake somewhere. I know soft tires are not going to hold up, but it looks like Archchief is on the hard tires is looking really good right now. Like they're gotten to DRS of Swag, so they'll get the DRS off them because I assume that V car that V car will pit this lap. We'll have to see, because I assume they will. Obviously, as well with. Tyler pitting onto the hard tires, by the way. That's put Mickey into the podium places. It looks like Vo Vossi. Oh, yep, there we go. Swag is into the pits. After five laps, he's getting rid of the soft tires. Probably going onto the hard tire. Will I find out in a second? Is it hard? It looks like it is. Yep. Yeah. Hard to go onto that V carb. Z looking for a move down into turn four. Mickey on the inside. Trying to take the podium place away, but they made a small mistake and it's somewhat almost semi span there. Let's see if they can try it again. Like, look at them, they're all over the back of me. And like, Archchief is slowly catching them up behind. But I think this is the point where the mediums are going to start dying and the hearts are just better. I don't know. The tire wear is very odd right now in this game. On some tracks, it wears out way too fast, the tires. I'll have to see if Zeke will make a move in turn one. Oh, Mickey looking slow there out of turn 11. Mickey looking might have made a mistake looking very slow then. Because Zeke almost made a move on them. This is like with them battling, it's also laying an art sheath behind them to catch back up. Like, Archchief is only just under two seconds behind him. Let's we'll see if Zeke makes a move on Mickey into turn one. Right on board with the Mercedes driver. DRS flying wide open. Getting the slipstream. Pulling alongside. It's going to be battle of the brakes because they're still side by side. He's going to break later. It looks like the Mercedes. It looks like Mickey's just going to settle in behind. So the Mercedes currently takes the P P3 away from, from the McLaren. And Archchief is really catching them back up. I think Mickey might go for a move round the outside at turn four. This would be a lovely move if this pulls off for Mickey. Still side by side as they come into turn, turn five, six, and seven. Still going at it to they are. But now Mickey's pulled back out of it. And because of all that, look at this. The Ferrari of Archchief is like right on the back of them now. After having a bit of a miserable start, the Ferrari is somehow now back on, back up to these two. Also as well, to go bear in mind as well, Tyler could catch him as well. I think Tyler's also made a slight mistake again at turn. Just looked like he was very slow there, so he made a, made a mistake. So Zeke, so seven laps into this race, Vossi is in the lead with a seven second gap over Adri. Who then has a nine second over Zeke. And obviously Miki in fourth. Archchief is going to need to try and get... Within DRS, he's only a second off. Wants to see if he gets it. So there's the DRS detection. Yep, I think he's definitely got DRS. And then nine seconds behind him is Tyler. And 15 seconds behind him is Swag. So we'll keep on board with these three because this is the most interesting battles of the rest because these three are all close together. Is Mika going to look for girlfriend turn one? No, he's not. Oh, Ashley's a bit late on the brakes there. Almost hits Mika. It's the back of Mickey there. I 
wants to see if the McLaren goes to the move in turn four again. They're thinking better of it. Oh, she has a lo lost a little bit of ground, but I assume they'll get get it back up. Like this is a lovely helicopter helicopter camera angle. Loving this. You can see all three and all three of them in the in the camera. But look, is the gaps also looking all the same as well? It's just the question is when are these medium runners gonna bail off those medium? Oh, what's up with the Archief there? What has just happened to the, the Ferrari? Is that just a big snap of oversteer coming out of that corner? So if that was, that's un that is very unfortunate for the Ferrari. Let's just see if Mickey can keep in DRS of Zeke's. Ooh, a little little wobble there from Mickey, and they might have just dropped out of DRS. He's gonna try and get try and get it. Lines there. Nope, they don't get it. Oh, looks like Adri's in into the pits. Looks like they're gonna get rid of their mediums after eight laps. Bossy still in a comfortable position. Obviously, with Adri pitting, that gives. Z and Mickey the podium places. I'll have to see where he comes out compared to Ta where they come out to compare to Tyler, but Tyler's like massively ahead of them. Obviously Tyler's been on these laps for these tires for about what five, six laps? Have a quick look. Four laps. Oh! Mickey and Z are fighting again. Looks like um the, I don't know who made a mistake, but one of them made a mistake. Because um, Mickey's back ahead. Unless Mickey got DRS into turn one and then used DRS to try and pass him into turn four. Or either that or Zeke made a mistake and Mickey got passed. I think pretty much at this point as well, Vossi almost has a free pit stop. Well, Vossi does definitely have a free pit stop to Adri. But I think they also have one to Tyler because Tyler's two seconds behind Archchief. Then four seconds behind Z. Let's look at the gaps earlier. Yeah, so I think if Vossi was to pit now, they would either come out just in front of Archchief or just behind them. If I remember correctly, pit stops up the Bahrain circuit is uh, like 22 to 24 seconds, depending if you have a slow stop. So always, it could be like 20 seconds. Oh, Mickey is into the pits, bailing off those mediums after eight, nine laps. That puts Archchief into the podium place. They're being caught by Tyler right now. <coughs> Sorry about that. Oh, looks like Archchief has made another mistake there on the hot on those hard tires. So say those hard tires shouldn't you shouldn't they shouldn't really have it be any issue on those hard tires. But they are they are nine lap old tires. So we'll have to see what happens. So far Vossi also has a Vossi's got a twenty twenty one seconds to Z in second. But I think at this point Vossi does pretty much have a free pit stop. We'll have to see if um Oh, hello. Someone just left the session now. Was it the V card there? I saw someone's name leave the session. I'm not sure if it's the. I think it may have been the V card there of Ad Adri. Oh, yep. Yeah, Vossi is in. Let's just see where Zeke. Will Zeke get them? Or will Zeke pit as well? Because bear in mind, we're, we're really comparing where Vossi's going to come out compared to Tyler. Because Tyler was in second place when he pit off those softs. We'll have to see where Tyler, how far Tyler beh is behind Vossi. Tyler's across line, so yep, Z is in. We'll have to see if um, Z. Wow, Vossi only just comes out in front of Tyler, so I think it's going to be like two seconds the gap between the two of them. But Vossi is on six lap fresher tyres. So after one lap, Vossi will probably get those tyres up to temperature and away they go. Let's see where Zeke comes out compared to Mickey because Mickey picked the lap earlier. Will they get... Oh no, we're going to be like free wide into turn one here. 
Oh, but Mickey's all the way around the outside. And they're still side by side. Oh, but Mickey got DRS. Mickey got DRS. So Swag's also back up in back in these three. So these three, they all pit one lap. Well, Swag pit like five laps ago and was cat caught the back of Mickey because of Mickey pit. Five of that or Mickey passed them. But we'll have to see. I'm also going to have to see this gap between Tyler and Vossi. See if it comes down. But I'm not sure if it will come down. Uh, let's just... Some of these used to go fast as that. So Vossi has the fastest lap by five tenths. But that's probably set on the thing. But obviously Archchief hasn't pitted yet. Other than that, everyone's pretty much in the same place where they started. I also... Seaton swag all together again. Like they were before they all pitted. Obviously we've got to bear in mind. Oh Archchief, Archchief, Archchief. Very unlucky. Got the ten seconds to speed in, in the pits. I assume the mediums are going on that Ferrari. Yep, they are. So uh, I think as long as Archchief just finishes the race, they'll get some po get points. But not Archchief is just not having a good day by the look of it. Oh, Z is right on the back of Mickey. Oh, tried to get on the inside of Mickey in turn one there. So they have the. It would have been. Well, they would have been on the outside for turn two, then turn three on the inside. DRS wide up, and now Z looks like they're going to make the move into turn four. Side by side, they both go, but looks like the Mercedes driver's up into, up into P4. So uh, I was trying to keep an eye on the gap between Vossi and Tyler, but like the. The gap is just getting away from Tyler. So I think I think the Aston Martin will have to settle for P2. Because uh, Bossy is just too fast. Be just too good this track. Or um, play the strategy to perfection. Love to see if Zeke can build a gap here to to Mickey. I don't know if they will or not. Because the gap between Zeke Mickey Swagger, like, pretty close. Oh, but Vossi's made a mistake because Tyler's caught like seven tenths. Wasn't Vossi. I swear Vossi was like 2.4 ahead and that was only 1.7. So it looks like Vossi's made a small mistake somewhere. Because the gap is now back to two seconds. I'll have to see what happens here between these three. See if, but Mickey's a bit too far, but like still has DRS, but I think it's too far back from Z. We will get DRS for the next straight. Let's see if Mickey can mount a charge back, but a little bit of little bit of um snap of other snap there. Oh, we got Archchief uh, facing the wrong way. That is so that Ferrari has not having a good day. Archchief is not having a very good to, good day today. Maybe it'll maybe next week they'll have a it'll be better for them. I'll have to find out. It looks like um looks like Mickey is now dropped back off the back of Zeke to like over a second between them. But then it's also over a second between Mickey and Swag, so the gap is coming down. Also as well, I think as Adri is disconnected, still, I don't think they've had a chance to reconnect it. Like, they're losing a lot of time and put them back up. I think, I think Adri's going to lose the podium here. Let's...
I will try and get Ad Adri back in, but I think the damage is done. Even if they add me, then I can get him back in. Looks like Zeke's going to get, get past them because they're in AI. It's just... Oh, but the, because Adri's in AI, the AI got very defensive there. But it still goes through. Let's quickly... Let's quickly get back here. I shouldn't ask them, not just add them in. There we go. Let's see if Adrian joins back. I hope they're back in. Mickey's gonna go for Mickey's gone for the move into turn one. I want to see if the V comes back in. If they're back in. They can maybe ba try and battle to try and catch back up. Apparently, according to them on Discord, they keep. That's a shame. If that's the case, they can't can't take control. That is a that is a shame for them because they're running so well in P3. I said Tala's coming to her pits again. I suppose because they had like a 20 second gap to Z, they could. They've come back out on a set of medium. I don't know why they just didn't put another set of softs on. Obviously, Z will get DRS. Did they get DRS? Nope. Tyler is weaving there. I, I say, I wouldn't be weaving there if I was you. Obviously, Z like right on the back of you. Obviously, Mickey's now dropped back even further. Two, two seconds back. I want to see what tire, what how long, how old people's tires are. The so Zeke pit a lap later. Mickey, five lap old tires. Six. Swag pit like lap six. That's why their tires are ten laps old. And Adri pit lap eight. Obviously, Tyler had a plenty of time to Vossi, so he went. He went for a full, went for another pit stop. Looks like, cause, looks like Vossi's doing the same thing. Cause yeah, cause Tyler pit Vossi has literally a free pit stop window, and has Vossi gone onto the soft tires? I assume they have. Yes, they have. Vossi is on the soft compound tire. Probably looked, they're gonna look to extend their fastest lap. We're on lap 17 of of 20 so far. Bossy is the race leader, just pitted again for soft tires because the gap they have to Tyler was massive. It's now come down to five seconds, but that's because they both pit. Obviously, Tyler is probably gonna try and take the fastest lap away from from Bossy. Let's see what the, the fastest lap is a 130.7 from Vossi. Tyler's fastest lap is a full second slower. So we'll have to see what Tyler can do. Let's just put the, not that one on. That one. Because this will keep track of how fast Tyler goes. Because we're right, right on board of Tyler. Because they'll have first chance to try and take fastest lap away from Vossi. But then Vossi will have be able to answer straight back. Because they're on the soft tyres on, on a new lap. Because obviously... Because they pitted, their first sector will be slow as slow as anything. So we'll have to see 
Love to see what Tyler does. How much faster are they in the middle sector as they come across the checkpoint now? It's 1.7. The purple middle sector. We'll have to see what they can do coming up to our line. Obviously, they're three seconds back from Vossi. But will they take the fastest lap away from Vossi for the time being? Because Vossi will just take it straight back next lap. Across the line for Tyler. And he does take it away from Vossi with a 129.7. But Vossi will now have a shot at taking that taking that straight back away from Tyler. Because compared to because they're on the soft tires compared to the Aston's mediums. There's there's big gaps between everybody. There's like no real battling anymore. But it's now just, it's now basically just a battle for the um for the fast slap. Bossy was like three tenths up there in the first sector of their person personal best, which is a 130.7. I'll have to see what it's gonna be. So yeah, Tyler's fastest lap is almost a full second faster than Vossi's best lap. So we'll have to see if um Vossi can make a big improvement in this middle sector. To try and take that fastest lap up away from Tyler across the second sector split there 1.4 improvement so Vossi's fastest only a second slow with that 1.4 up realistically they should get fastest lap back wants to see if they will but I'm pretty sure they will round in the last couple corners up to the line oh we've had a spinner up to the line and takes it back 1.9 faster um, I wonder if Tyler's improved their best lap. No, they haven't. So, with all, and also one of the one of the V cabs had a small spin at the towards the back. So, I f I feel like if Tyler and Vossi might, were maybe on the same strategy, I think these two could have actually had a massive fight for the race win. But they chose different strategies. Vossi started on the mediums, uh, went then went to hards, and obviously when. Tyler pitted for new tyres because they start on the softs, went to hards. Then, because I think they had a massive gap to Z, they decided, ah, what the heck, we'll just pit, we'll just pit, go for fastest lap. But Vossi was then like, ah, I see your plan, I'm now going to do the same thing. I wonder if um, Archchief pit again. I feel like they have. Yeah, they have. Oh, Archchief's also on the softs. Archchief is five tenths up in their middle sector. Archchief will probably set a personal best here. Yep. Archchief will get a personal best. I think that's what we're looking at right now. Is just like who's, who's gonna just set fast? Who's just gonna go for faster slap? Because like I said, the, the field's just all scattered. No one's really catching up. It looks like Tyler's made a mistake somewhere because Deep has caught. I swear the gap between Tyler and Z was like 11 seconds up. I had it. Oh, it's that's why now. Uh, the gap's getting bigger because I had it on that one. <laughs> I'm a terrible commentator. I can't even get the right graphics on. This is a great start. <laughs> so we're on the final lap then. It looks like this is going to be a comfortable win for the McLaren of Vossi. Unless they pick up a couple penalties in the last couple laps. But I don't think they will. Because that's what I was going to point out. Archchief has already got rid of their... Already got rid of their 10 seconds, so... Unless somebody picks up a 3 second time penalty in this last lap, which... I don't think is going to happen. We're going to have a very, very clean race where no one's got a 3 second penalty. Which is rare, I will say. In every race I've seen, every, someone's always got a penalty. I think this is the first time I'm going to see that no one's going to have a penalty unless somebody ruins it in the last lap. If somebody ruins it, I'll be annoyed. <laughs> so here we come then. Vossi in the last, into the last sector. Onto the, the second to last straight. I can see Tyler in the background. They're going to be like six seconds back on the road. But here comes Vossi. Ran in the last couple corners. Foot to the floor. Checker flag is out. Across the line comes Vossi to win, to win the first tier two race 
but Aurora Racing League here in Bahrain. Tyler will get second. Now we just wait for Zeke to round out the podium in that Mercedes. Up to the line they come. There we go. Zeke gets the po last podium. Vicky will take P4. A good drive good drive for Mickey after the, they've had like zero running on this game. So that's a good showing for me. Because they had a very good battle with Zeta and Swag is just crossing the line now. Again, we feel I feel sorry for Adric because of the DC they had so they could rejoin the race. They, they lagged across the line there, so crossed it twice. Okay. And now we just wait for Archie for across the line. Looks like they're going to beat their personal best lap. Now the question is, will they steal... If they lap their setting, is it going to steal that point from Bossy? Find out. Round in the last couple corners now for the Ferrari driver. Got no battery left, but coming up to the line... Nope, they're not going to steal it. They do set a new personal best. So... Seat will get the driver of the day as well. Very nice. Now we move on to the podium celebration. We'll have um, Vossi on the top step. It'll be Vossi, Tyler, and as your top three finishers. This Bahrain Grand Prix. Now I'm tab out and have a look next on the calendar because I honestly cannot remember. Ah! We're going to Silverstone. So there's the final final results there. So Vossi takes the win. Tyler P2. Zeep 3. Then Mickey. My Adri and then Archie back. Now I'm going to look at the race. Um, can I look at the. Okay, so there we go. Incidents. Nobody got one is for trap limits. Interesting. That is interesting. So now obviously drivers have some time to submit reports any incidents they saw in the race or any or let's include qualifying and a race and we will oops, next next weekend next race day or oh, I believe it's the Brit British Grand Prix just double check on discord yeah we we'll see what Silverstone for the next for the next race so obviously as well, and today was some good clean racing I saw as well. But I'm just going to leave it at that, and we will see you next week for the Silverstone Grand Prix. With a Tier 1 race on the Saturday, and a Tier 2 on the Sunday. Hopefully I should be here to commentate. Now, for the next one.